guys this is the uh, rocky ridge ranch here and it looks beautiful we just came here you're gonna check out the trails just wanted to give a quick shot about the area it looks like all the easier trails are closer here and as you get down into the woods it gets a little more complicated but uh, this is, looks pretty good just gonna check it out I'll keep you guys posted cool tractor out there and I can hear some wind chimes out here that's pretty cool I'm not sure if the camera catches it things first I think I need to adjust the brick so that it doesn't uh, I have the I don't have to bend that far down for me to apply the brick that's number one number two is I think the handlebars need to be a little higher but I'm not going to worry about it right now because I don't want to engage in that as yet. Number three is it is looking pretty good. Let's try to go downhill on this one. <laughs> Dude, if you look at the rock, you're hitting the rock. That's what it is. That's what it is. So don't look at the rock. Okay, that was a easy changing gears. Okay, brake, brake, the brake. Hmm. Hills. It's gonna be tough to get back from the hill. So maybe I should just stick to parts, pick the parts where it's easier to go. You know? How about that hill there? Let's go back there to that hill. Go back up there. See how that seems like easy enough here. legs okay give it some bit of throttle give it some bit of throttle that was cool that was cool that was cool you need bit of throttle 
I think a second gear would be better. You need more throttle. But that was out of control. That was out of control. Slightly cambered hill too, so that was interesting. Okay, let's go back down here. Okay, that was fun. So let me go ahead and check out some more trails. Okay, uh, recap. First thing you want to do is you want to hold your legs, uh, hold the bike with your legs. That is number one. Immediately freeze off all your hands and your controls and the bike moves around so it becomes really, really easy. After that, it just kick, kick walk. Second thing is uh, the quick shifter really helps in changing the gears. <laughs> you don't have to worry about the clutch. And uh, the third thing is, yeah, y you know, uh, I forgot. But the third thing is, it is so much fun. <laughs> Man, this thing is unbelievable. The bike is just phenomenal. It is uh, a little bit of effort, but I think that's because I'm still learning the bike. But otherwise, it just takes <laughs> stuff like, as if, you know, like a bulldozer going through, uh, you know, a brush or something. It's just too good, too good. Okay, well, let's go ahead and let's see what we got here. Yep, change the gears. Okay, use, yeah, use my legs automatically. Oh, this is going to be difficult. Let the bike go where he wants to go. Oh, <laughs> Ooh. that was difficult. So just pick the, pick a different trail. Okay, this is probably going to be the final challenge. <laughs> the water, the gradient, the gravel, the rocks, the mountains. I did the left hand side part of it, but to go through the right hand side and into the water, uh, I still got some ways to go. I guess I don't want to end that hill out there. I guess it's just that I'm not keen on trying out something on my own if I drop the bike or something. <laughs> but uh, I 
guess there are a bit of challenges here. There are a lot of challenges here. I think eventually we should get to a point where you're pretty comfortable on this big bike, going slow through the rocks, standing up all the time, which I'm doing right now. Standing up is coming easily. I, I'd rather stand than sit even in really, really slow speeds. As soon as the bike takes off, I'm standing. Because otherwise, you know, sitting is just, <laughs> just you're going to drop the bike. Anyway, that was it. Fantastic.